What's going on, Tia Tuku gang? All right, I'm bringing my hair down about a fourth. And then I'm leaving my um, remaining part of my hair loose because that is what I'm going to be joining with the hair I bought to make my twist. So I'm thinking I'm about to be doing uh, about six sections across. Not for sure just yet. All right, on the fourth section. Oh, as I'm getting here to this fifth part, get a little apprehensive because my hair is thin on the right, yikes. Let's see if I can do one section right here. And if that's gonna work, uh, don't like it, taking it down. I'm gonna do a smaller square. Remember, it doesn't have to be all uniform. We're going for a natural look. Let's see. Ah, nope. All right, want at least two sections. That looks a lot better. So instead of six parts, I did seven. I'm cool with that. Now it's time to grab my needle and my hair. I love that it is sectioned off. You want this needle to go in the direction of how you want the hair to flow. So I'm going in a downward motion, hook the hair on, I close up the clamp, and I push the hair through under the hair. I just want to pull one side over, and then I measure the hair. And then I'm going to begin twisting. You want to make sure you have a good grip and you're twisting the hair firmly, because when you get down to the end, to tie the hair in a knot to make sure it's secure. When you release your hands, the twist is going to expand some. So it's not gonna look as tight as when you twisted it the first go round. All right, let me show you again here. So I've anchored the hair onto the needle. I pushed it through one side, measured it. So it's the same length and I began twisting. Make sure you put some W40 on those fingers because you're going to be needing the your twist game to be tightened up. All right, I'm geek. Yay! We in here. All right, so now I'm finding my rhythm and I'm happy with that because then you know you're on the money and then now you can finally get into the hairstyle. Don't worry about if you're not as fast as someone else. Please go at your own pace. All is well. Um, just to give you a little background about this hair, um, I did buy it from my local beauty supply store. This is the Sensational brand, and it was $10. It comes with three bundles in a pack. Oh, here goes the Safu. We all get those from time to time when we're doing our hair. But all is well. All right, I got my rhythm going. I'm feeling like a bag of money, uh-huh. Yep, I said it, a bag of money. <laughs> All right, now you want this crochet needle to go in the opposite direction because we don't want all of our hair to fall the same and it's just the same process again. We want to make sure once again um, this is staying as natural as possible because it's supposed to kind of give like, you know, that bohemian girl look. We don't want to put too much of uh, any products on there. That's not what we're trying to do. You almost want someone to come up to you and say, oh, you know, is that your hair or um, did you lock your hair? That's the whole effect that I want to go for. Sometimes we have ideas about locking our hair, but we don't want to do it just yet. So, you know, thankfully we can go and get some hair and do hairstyles in the meantime. All right, we on the last section on the front row. Oh man, this is like better than go because my arms has already been going through a little work. But it's all good because I know the ending outcome is going to be the bomb. So I'm thinking I'm going to go seven across and four down. 
Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. And thank you for watching this video. You're getting ready to see the ending result soon. And I'm looking forward to seeing you on my next video. Hey everyone, here goes the final hairstyle. I love it. I love this hair. This is what I was going for. I wanted that natural look, bohemian look. I don't even want to put any mousse on it because that's just going to take away from the effect, you know? I wanted to just kind of give me that rugged, you know, island girl, island, you know, girl vibes. And it's giving me that. So I would love to hear about your success stories when you try the hairstyle. And would love to see your pictures too. So make sure you send them to my business inquiry email, which is down below in the description. And I'll make sure that I will post your pictures with your permission on my next upcoming videos. Until then, please like, subscribe, leave the comments down below. Let me know how you're feeling. Guess what on this channel is about to be all kind of things going on. You are in for a treat, trust me. Until then, Tia Too Cool.